up everybody so for those of you who do not know me my name is tyra nicole and yeah welcome to my channel thank you for clicking my video and let's just go ahead and get into it so as you can tell by the title i'm getting a puppy i'm getting a yorkie and i'm naming him toto if you've seen cheetah girls then you know where i got the name from so i think i'm gonna do a little puppy haul show y'all what i got for him already all right so it's two weeks later i'm super late yeah. like showing y'all yeah <laughs> I'm super late showing y'all what I got Toto, but yeah, we got so late for Toto for yeah. that. Yeah, we're so sorry about that, but we're, we're so sorry for that. <laughs> 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 Guys, I want to tell you something. So I got my nose better. So look. Yeah, she hurt her nose. Yeah. A couple weeks ago, but it's yeah. getting better. Yeah, it's gonna better. We're we, still gonna. We got we're, some. <laughs> um before i even show y'all the next clip let me give y'all a little update yeah school's been stressing me out like stay-at-home moms don't get enough credit like i see so many uh moms at work shame stay-at-home moms thinking that we got it made blah 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 no we don't like it is a blessing don't get me wrong i love being able to stay home with my kids and stuff like that um super thankful for that but at the same time, when it comes to doing like schoolwork and focusing, it's very hard to do that unless everybody is asleep. So yeah, it's just been stressful for me this semester. And it's not necessarily that the classes are hard. It's just simply that I, I haven't had time to focus to study. It's just been a struggle for me. And that's why I have not posted because I can't even focus on my own schoolwork. So I decided to take a break next semester in the spring and um, I'm a, continue okay. either in the summer or wait until the fall next fall to like you know finish school it's gonna set me back you know graduating and stuff but i really need this for my mental health all right it's literally the next morning i look a hot mess but i forgot to say something like most of y'all came from my apartment tour video and i know y'all are looking forward to the furnished apartment tour and the reason why i haven't even posted that or decorated is because me and my boyfriend decided that we're actually moving in the summer when our lease is up our son's a big boy now and both of our kids have a lot of stuff each and it's just like impossible for them to share a room so hopefully the plan is to find a house an actual house in the summer and whenever we do move i'm gonna do a, a tour whether it's apartment townhome house whatever we choose i'm gonna do a tour and then i'm gonna for real for real decorate then so just stay tuned be patient with me and yeah enjoy the rest of my content i hope y'all enjoy the rest of my content like i'm gonna do a whole bunch of different stuff so yeah just stay tuned and thanks again for supporting me nova's gonna show you his like snacks and stuff and then i'm gonna show you guys what's going on over here so this big old thing right here is actually a baby playpen which we got for our son but our son doesn't stay in there longer than five minutes. So I was like, maybe I should put Toto's little playpen inside of the big playpen. That way he can go in and out and feel like he has more like, you know, freedom and isn't so isolated and stuff. So yeah, this is a little setup. Here's his little toys and stuff like that. We're currently potty training. He's trying, he's actually improving. Like I said, we got him two weeks ago and He's starting to get the hang of it somewhat like he'll pee on it but he for some reason he don't want to poop on it and i don't know we're gonna have to work on that but here is his little doggy bowl i'm gonna show them his food this is okay this is his snacks mm -hmm. so i show him this snack so he just he was a good boy in his snack so i'm so proud of him you're so proud of him for being a good boy yeah yeah, this is his uh yeah. setup. Yeah, this is his snack food up. And I feel proud of him and I gave him some food candies. This I got from Home Goods. It was only like six dollars. I got his treat jar from Home Goods. This was like nine dollars. In here I have some pepperoni treats. Um, I don't have the bag, but I'll try to insert a picture so you guys can see what it is. And then I also have these Zooks Mini Naturals. Right here, I have like a little toy doggy bone. It's bacon flavored, but he actually doesn't like this. So I just put it here for now. And then right here, I have like a little storage type thing. Excuse me, baby. 
And I'm only gonna put stuff in the um, top drawer. So I just have his food. He's on pedigree. This is what his breeder had him on. He got a brush. Here is the shampoo that I have used on him. I got him some waste bags in here. I got these from Home Goods. 360 bags for $6.99. You can't beat that. And then I just have some more puppy pads. <clears throat> and that's pretty much it. Over time, I'll get him some more things. Um, and you wanna, are you ready to show them Toto? Yeah. All right, okay. you can open it. You can show them Toto. Okay. Open? Yeah, go ahead. This is Toto. <laughs> He just likes me. So this is Toto right here. So I like him. So he, he, he likes me. <laughs> yeah, he likes you. You love your puppy? Uh, yeah, because he loves <laughs> <laughs> So I almost forgot to show you guys his collar. This is a collar I got from PetSmart. It's in a size extra small and it's actually too big for him. So that's why it's not on him. And then I got him this little uh, dog tag made with his name on it. And then it has my phone number below. And it also has a little bell on it. That way when he can actually fit it, where he's so small, I will always know where he is because of the bell. So yeah, there's that. Quick little story. Nova was actually scared when I told her we was getting a dog. She don't like big dogs like me. Um, you would never catch me with no big dog. I like little dogs. And yeah, when she finally seen him, she was like, oh, you won't hurt me. <laughs> you love Toto, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. They're always playing together. Um, Toto doesn't know too many tricks besides sit. So, I'm gonna get these little treats right here because he loves these. So. All right, so I broke a piece of the treat. Toto, come here, baby. Sit. Toto, sit. Good boy. Good boy, Toto. Good boy. Toto, sit. sit. Good boy. No. Okay, wait. Good boy. Good boy, Toto. Um, yeah, the training part is kind of hard to do when like the kids are around, not even gonna lie. So I usually try to do that either late at night or early in the morning when they're asleep. Because, you know, they're so excited and it's just a distraction for Toto, honestly. Uh-oh, be careful. All right, Sunset's up from a nap. Uh, what are you doing? Nothing, just having fun. You're just having fun, okay. Oh, good cheer. All right, while they're doing that, um, let's see what Toto's doing. Come here, baby. Come here. Come here, baby. Come here, Toto. Mommy. What, baby? Well, get off the chair like that. Get off the chair like that. Okay, put it up where it's supposed to go. Thank you, my love. Thank you. You okay? <laughs> All right, let me change my son's diaper because I can't have him walk around like that. Be right back. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. So again, this is Toto and he's 10 weeks old. I got him when he was eight weeks old, two weeks ago. Um, When he first came home, he was like really shy, really quiet. Now he's like really outgoing and fun to play with and all that stuff. He's definitely like comfortable now. Um, Yeah. He's definitely comfortable. The reason why I got him, even though my life is a little like hectic, like busy. When I say hectic, I mean like busy with school and kids and all that stuff. Um, being a stay at home mom right now is actually an, an advantage for me when it comes to having a puppy because 
have time to train with him and stuff. Versus when I graduate, I'll most likely be working at a hospital, working 12 hour shifts. And I know for a fact, then I will not have no time to like train a dog. What else? There's really not much else to know about Toto. Um, yeah, he's just a part of the family now. So y'all will be seeing him often, which is the main reason kind of why I wanted to make this video anyways. I wanted to introduce our newest addition to the family. I love him. He's so precious. You wanna get down? But yeah, that's all I really wanted to tell y'all. If you like me, just join the family. Why not, you know? Bye, everybody. <laughs>